Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I told you guys I was going to do some more Final Fantasy 14 content, and I'm really excited for this one. So, for anybody that doesn't know, one of my favorite Final Fantasies of all time was Final Fantasy X. That game was a goddamn masterpiece for me. I 100% of that game on multiple occasions. And when I found out who the boss of this dungeon was, I didn't care how easy or hard the dungeon was going to be. I knew I had to... Uh, jump in and check it out. So, for anybody that doesn't know, the boss of this dungeon, oh shit, is Anima. <laughs> and, uh, I'm hyped. Sorry, I just got embarrassed because it uh, turns out I did not have my tank suits on. So, if you guys saw my last video, I was messing around with Reaper. I still am leveling up Reaper, and it is, I'm starting to have a lot of fun with it. I'm also leveling up Sage, and I'm, I started doing the storyline on my Gunbreaker. Gunbreaker was actually my main class back in Shadowbringers before I stopped playing, and I missed it a lot. And now we're here, trying to fuck shit up. All right, so first off, beginning of this dungeon's kind of dope. I like the fact that we have, you know, the whole uh, the whole crew. I'm gonna keep it pushing a little bit. Pop some cooldowns. Go. So that's me spinning in the middle. Trying to keep myself alive. Ooh, a prizal. I should use a prizal. My prizal hits a lot of enemies. I'm gonna try and blow through this fast so it's not this video is not too long. And I did want to have some friends here to do this with, because I thought the commentary would be great, but they couldn't make it. So keep an eye on that for the next one. Because I am having way too much fun with this game to not be making more content about it. Alright, let's rock and roll. Oh, all right. First boss, let's go. Barnabas. I see two and three. All right, let's get it. So I can't see the name Barnabas and not immediately think of Final 16 with Barnabas Storm, who, by the way, was a, a fantastic villain. Forgot to put, I forgot about my dot. I was on Reaper all day long, so I gotta get back into my uh, Gunbreaker mentality. Uh, I don't like the look of that. Oh, that's a, this guy's using purely physical attacks. Oh. My gnashing fan would come off cooldown right before I use burst strike. Uh, that means he's gonna push me away. That's last what I meant last time. Oh, he pulled me in. All right, I gotta remember that. We're gonna build up some cartridges. All right, let's go off. I love the fact that uh, Gunbreaker has a six hit combo. All right, this one's gonna push me away, I guess. I'm not sure what I was supposed to do there, but I guess I, it worked out. I didn't die. Right, let's go. I was not in the right spot. Can you tell I've never done this, this dungeon before? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, I'm coming. Alright, we soaked. Fine. Beat his ass. We're doing ground upon the gun. Almost got him. Burst him, burst him. Take him out, take him out. 
All right. Nice. Do I want any of this? I kind of want that. I don't want that. Oh, that's cool. Look at look. We got we have the NPCs fighting in the background. That's that's pretty dope. All right, I like this dungeon. I like this dungeon a lot. Die already. All right. Oh, what the hell is this? I don't know how I feel about that. Alright, pulling ahead. Oh, we can't go any farther, that sucks. Spin the wind. Can't even see myself. Oh, uh, that's why I left the next boss already. Alright. Blue gay. Alright. Everybody here. Let's get it. Put my dot on. Start mixing in some off -goals. Yeah, I messed that up. I should have waited on that. Alright. Still getting in the field for it again. I'll be doing big damage before you know it. Get over here. I wasn't done with you. Uh, I went to sound of that. What does this mean? Uh, I don't know what any of this means. I just turned to a toad. I just got mini. Oh shit! I may have messed up here. I can't move. I'm slow. All right, we're alive. All right, let's uh, let's hit him with reprisals. Reduce his damage a little bit. Alright, we're good, we're good. Alright, we're gonna start, we're gonna build up our stacks and go for a nice, a nice burst. So his gnashing fan's about to come up full down. Alright, let's get it. We'll use our buff to increase our damage. So, some defense. Make the job of the healer job a little easier. All right. I don't know which one we're supposed to use. I guess this is where we use mini. Ah, so that way it goes over us. I get it. That's kind of clever. I like how they did that. Oh, and the other one we were underwater. That's why we wanted it to be a frog. I get it. All right, we smoked that one, and we got to level up. Ooh, which give us enhance uh, aura. So now we get two charges of aura, which basically means we can heal ourselves twice. I like that. All right, let's roll. Did I say aura? It's aurora. My bad. Let's rock and roll. I want to kill things. Do a couple attacks, get the aggro. I don't like that. What's with like that claw machine?
Oh my god, I can't see anything! It's alright, just keep pressing buttons. It'll all die eventually. My health's not going too crazy. Healer's doing good. Draw some single targets. Alright, cool. Bro, those claws are scaring me. I like this. I feel like I, I definitely feel like I have more Aurors. Aurors. That's good because that, that move saves lives. Uh, oh shit. There he is. They really put Anima in this goddamn game. Technically, Anima is a she. I don't know if you guys know this, but the faith for Anima was Seymour's mother in Final Fantasy X. Obviously, now it's the body of of the the Emperor of Garlemald, but still, I can't believe it. The icon of icons, man. I'm so excited for this fight. Uh. All right, let's go. Uh, I don't know what this means. I don't know what any of this is. I forgot to put my dot. Oh God, oh God. All right, now we know. Now we know what that does. All good, all good. Mega Graviton. Uh, I'm gonna give my party some some magic defense. Good move, good move. Go so roar around myself. Uh, uh, I'm gonna reprisal him. Oh god, I didn't expect to get snatched like that. Anima begins feeding on souls. What do you mean? I guess we just beat it up. Bro, hop off. Me no like this. This is scary. Alright, alright. We're, we're good, we're good, we're good. Gonna pop both of these. Throw out one of those. And we go on for C. Two. What is happening? What is happening? <gasps> Anima's other half! I hope to God Anima beats my ass. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Anima's overdrive. Literally, she would unchain herself, pull the enemy into, the, into this world that we're in right now, and punch you so hard and so fast that it changed the beat of the goddamn soundtrack. Like, it was one of the craziest overdrives in all of Final Fantasy X. And if that is a mechanic in this game, if, that, if that's what that bar is for, I might just lose my mind. I went into this fight completely blind. I had, hadn't seen anything about it. I just knew that Anima was here. Uh, I'm going to just reprisal you. Give my party some damage. Put these on. And was almost dead. Okay. 
The altered reality plunges into chaos. Okay, I, I'm guessing if we hadn't killed it before that bar fill, we would have uh, auto died. This! It, it's doing it! It's doing it! It's oblivion! They really had her do her overdrive as an actual mechanic in the boss fight. I am so satisfied with this fight. I would have probably preferred this to be a trial so I could do it on extreme. And hope they would be a little bit harder. But other than that, I'm pleased. DPS is doing a limit break. Good, good. Like, they could have made that, that damage check, like, a lot crazier on a trial than a dungeon boss. But, you know, beggars can't be choosers. I'm still happy enemies in the game. The dungeon before this was the Magic Sisters. We didn't... I, I didn't do a video on that one. Honestly, because I didn't expect it to be as good as it was. Because I really enjoyed that dungeon, too. But, and it was just too big a deal to me. We got it. Good dungeon. That was a really fun dungeon. Glory be to Golemald. Yeah. Fun boss. I definitely would have liked it more as a trial, though. That, that just... Anima is too big of a deal to not have as something you can fight as an extreme. But, either way, fun, fun. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the dungeon run. Keep you guys your eyes out for more Final Fantasy XIV content. If you guys want to check me out on social media, those links will be down below. That's it for me, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Later.